Daniel on Instagram had a very popular question as it turns out, the LiveView Solo Connect modems. These are really, really great modems that will help you stream from anywhere with the power of cellular bonding. First, I wanna stress the two flavors of the LiveView Solo. Uh, there's the LiveView Solo HDMI at $995. And then there's the LiveView Solo Premium, which comes with the SDI port and an HDMI port. And that's at $1,495. So those are your two options for an encoder. LiveView Solo Connect bundles. How do I set them up? It's easy as one, two, three. First, I pick the flavor of LiveView Solo that I want, be it HDMI or SDI and HDMI. And then I'm gonna add my hardware or my modems. So I can get a two modem kit like the one that I have on this LiveView Solo right here. I've got two little white modems. They come in at $450 for that hardware, or I can go even crazier and get the $650 three modem kit with a Wi-Fi hotspot that bonds with my cellular bonding and then I need to add my data plan. The price of those data plans for the two modem kit is $295 per month, and the three modems is $435 per month. Don't forget, you can also use your coupon code SOLO-VIDEOGUYS to receive 5% off. And I do want to stress, you won't be prompted to pay for that service plan until you have the hardware. So if you have your hardware and you're ready to go, then you'll be prompted to pay for your so service plan now, I thought this chart was really, really helpful based on some of the questions we've been getting for setup. And this is just a walkthrough on setting up your LiveView Solo. So first you buy your starter kit. That includes your Solo and your two modem or three modem kit so you have the hardware. Then you have to register your kit serial number on the LiveView Solo portal, which we'll bring up in just a minute. Choose your monthly or yearly data plan. So again, you won't be prompted to do that until you register your hardware modems. Enter your coupon code, in this case, solo-videoguys, and then your modems and SIMs are activated. Let's go into this, because I have some really great tips on how to do this. First, to register, the URL you need to go to is solo.liveview Dot TV. Again, that's solo.liveview.tv, and I'll bring it up in just a second, folks. Now, second, connect or register your LiveView Solo itself. This is really important. The portal is not going to let you register Solo Connect modems until you have your LiveView Solo already hooked up and ready to go because it needs to sync those modems with your LiveView Solo encoder. So the order of doing things is actually very important here. Remember, the serial code associated with the modems is not the one associated with the LiveView Solo. So if you purchased your Solo and your modems together, those are two separate serial codes, folks, and they both need to be registered. Se uh, second, all modems in the same kit have the same serial number. So if I have the two modem kit, which I do right here, these two modems share one serial number that needs to be registered for them. It's not two serial numbers, it's just one. And the same with the three modem kit, all three would share one serial number. And remember, the Solo Connect package and the service plan actually includes the LRT Cloud, which is that special sauce that bonds all of your different sources together. So your cellular bonding with your Wi-Fi, with your Ethernet, that's how you're getting that super signal is that LRT. Uh, perhaps the most important point here, modems may take 24 to 48 hours to activate. What does that mean? That means I can't activate my modems the night before a job. I must be prepared well in advance so that I'm ready to go with my LiveView Solo registered on a job where I may need them. Thank you for watching this highlight from the Video Guys Live webinar. If you like this video or you want to learn more, check out the full webinar in our description or head on over to videoguys.com for more information.